Hi, this is JP from No The Lights Over Arkham. This time I will be playing a two-handed playthrough of the Galaxy's Most Haunted's first scenario, a Drang. And we are playing with the Precon decks, with Ro uh, Rocket Raccoon and Groot. So Rocket Raccoon has the Aggression pre-built deck and Groot has the Protection pre-built deck. We are playing on standard difficulty. I will not be playing this as a campaign, so I will just demonstrate how the decks work straight out of the box and also how the scenario mechanics work. So even if I lose, I'll just continue to the next scenario to go over all of the scenarios as standalones. And I don't have to keep track of any uh, XP or or credits in this case or anything like that so uh, as I was testing out the scenarios first time I found out that uh, compared to the Red Skull uh, box this has a lot of more moving parts which is really good in my opinion but to make a demonstrative uh, video I think it's uh, enough that I'll just play the scenarios and you can see how the uh, encounters work so without further uh, talk let's get started okay so uh, first thing first let's go through the uh, setup so we have set up the padoom ship over here so we have to set up the padoom ship and the environment Milano. and then the encounter deck consists of uh, rank encounter set, uh, Brotherhood of Padoon and Ship Command and the standard encounter set. We have all uh, done all that. Then we'll flip this and there is two threat per player on the main scheme and uh, the threshold is 16. Uh, Drang has uh, 13 health per player, so 26 and there is a charge up special mechanic in this scenario so the Badoom ship will charge up and we place one barrage counter here then if there are four or more barrage counters here deal two indirect damage to each player and remove all barrage counters from here so uh, this Badoom ship will keep on charging up and deal us damage so for example the terrestrial invasion has forced response after the uh, resolving the step one of the villain phase so the Padoom ships charge up ability also when drunk schemes uh, we will resolve the charge up ability on Padoom ship and there may be some encounter cards if I remember correctly that will trigger that special but that's enough of that uh, we have creation of the decks let's draw our opening hand uh, Ra Rocket Raccoon will be the first player and the Milano asset will be uh, support will be in play on Rocket Raccoon so we get change them down Thruster boots, follow through, looking for trouble. I've got a plan and relentless assault. So, we don't have any enemies or minions yet, so I think this and this are quite useless. We could play the. I've got a plan to get rid of the threat to buy us some time. Uh, follow through might be okay to play. And I uh, think we can ditch these. So we draw four cards. Get another follow through. A rocket pistol, battery pack, and looking for trouble. Okay, well, uh, okay, starting hand. Then for the Groot starting hand, we get hard to ignore. Lashing vines. I am Groot the dwarf version um, so I think the difference with this is 
that this is not so shouting as the other. I am Groot, but yeah, I'm not gonna <laughs> shout for that that much. Okay, we get. Uh, uh, I think we will just set up Groot and not even go to hero form this turn. So I'll keep this um, this in hand and ditch this. And we get the uh, okay root stomp and jungle wines in Domidable. Okay, so a pretty much a setup turn for Groot. Okay, well, let's start playing. So uh, Rocket Raccoon is the first player. Uh, Rocket will play battery pack. So battery pack comes into play with two charges and these are not uses so even if this depletes we don't discard the rocket uh, the battery pack we'll get the rocket's pistol which comes into play with three charges and uh, I'll use the follow through for that okay we are not playing the follow through Oh yeah, on the first turn, the Milano can, uh, because we don't have anything to, uh, we could remove threat with this, but we can also play with, uh, play cards with it. So we have the first player action here. So exhaust Milano, remove three threat from this scheme. So uh, that is one way to get rid of the threat, but I think we are using the I've got a plan. So Rocket Raccoon will go to hero form. I will thwart for two and I'll play the I've got a plan. So we make a basic thwart using the thwart. We ready Rocket Raccoon. Uh, Rocket Raccoon gets plus one thwart while in hero form until the end of the phase. So we ready and we can thwart again. So we get rid of all of this. And uh, I'll save the Milano for Groot because Groot has a lot of uh, upgrades to play. So we want to play as many of those as we can this turn. Then uh, I'll use the rocket pistol to deal two damage to Krang. I'll use the battery pack to recharge the pistol. And that is... Um, yeah, that's the uh, rocket's turn so we go to Groot. Uh, first thing we do is to add two growth uh, counters on Groot. So Groot works that you will uh, build up the growth and when you if the maximum is 10 and many of the cards will function better the more growth you have. For example uh, I am Groot, removes threat from a scheme uh, equal to the growth counters, so that's really powerful when you have growth. Uh, but uh, I think we won't go to hero form this turn, so we can grow more next turn, but we'll play uh, cards down. So I'll just play hard to ignore. I'll play... Uh, I'll use the root stomp to play Flashing Vines, then I'll use the mm, I'll use the Indominable to play the Death Focus. I think we don't do anything else. Uh, this is a hero action, so well. Um, yeah, I, I think I'll still go to hero form, or no. I'll just keep this in hand. We don't have to rush because uh, Rocket is uh, already in hero form, so we're not getting that much threat. So uh, that is the hero turn. We'll uh, draw back up to our hand sizes and ready cards. So we get five on Rocket. So two into the phrase. Uh, Relentless Assault, Schadenfreude, 
and looking for trouble. Ruth gets six cards. Uh, Root Stomp, Starhawk, Harp, Ignore, I am Groot, Fighting Fit, uh, F Focus. Oh yeah, actually we didn't get this, uh, because we already had this in hand, okay. So we have the Changing Vines, Starhawk, Harp, Ignore, I am Groot, Fighting Fit, and Death Focus. We go to the Villain phase, uh, we add two Threat to the main scheme, uh, we add Charge up counter here. Uh, Drang will attack Rocket Raccoon. Uh, I won't defend. So, 2 plus 1 and give the villain a tough status. Okay. So, we get 3 damage. Then uh, Drang will scheme against Groot, so we add a charge up here. Then uh, uh, this doesn't do anything, so we add one threat. That's not that bad. Then we get the encounter cards. We get the Badoom Warlord. Uh, Badoom Warlord attacks gain overkill for health and free attack. Well, uh, Rocket can easily defeat that one, and then we get the Badoon Grunt. After Badoon Grunt engages you, if there are no other minions engaged with you, deal yourself one face down and counter card. Okay, so next turn we get this, this counter card for Groot also. So, uh, that was the villain phase, let's go to the next hero phase. And the first player marker moves to Groot. Uh, Groot will get two growth counters and uh, we start playing I think I'm uh, playing down the other heart to ignore we'll use the Milan for that then uh, we'll just flip I'll just defeat this guy like this and um, rocket can deal with that and remove the threat so, I think we can just focus on dealing damage. So, I'll call for an action. Uh, so, Rocket uses uh, the pistol to remove the tough. Then, I will use the depth focus. To play down the uh, entangling vines, just to play it. I'll use uh, I am Groot and Death Focus from hand. Play Fighting Fit. Fighting Fit deals five damage to the villain. Then uh, we keep the Starhawk in hand for now. Uh, that is all Groot can do. So we'll go to the Rocket Raccoon turn. I will. Uh, I really would like to play the Stratton Friday to heal up. I don't have quite enough resources to do that. I think I'll save it for next turn. So I use Into the Fray, Relentless Assault and Looking for Trouble to play Into the Fray. We deal 6 damage to Badoon Warlord, so it gets defeated and we overkill uh, by excess da damage is 2, so we remove 2 threat from the scheme. And uh, I'll use this battery pack. Oh yeah, and uh, after you deal excess damage to an enemy, draw a card. And uh, I think uh, Rocket could go down to heal, so I'll 
friends for this here. I'll flip down, heal for three. Then I will discard this. So we draw two cards. And uh, I'll use follow through and booster boots to play cyber magic skeleton. So we gain three hit points. Uh, I'll just do it like this. Okay. And we'll keep this in hand. And uh, that is all we can do. Uh, we'll draw back up to our hand sizes. The group gets to five cards. We get the wine shield, desperate defense, wine spikes, and rule storm. And uh, rocket gets. Uh, we get strength. We get particle cannon. Reload, chase them down, and genius. So, plenty of resources for next turn. And uh, okay, well, that is the hero phase. We go to the villain phase. We add two threats to the main scheme. We add a counter here. Rang will attack Groot. Oh, yeah, Groot is ready. So I will just defend for this attack. So two plus two is four. So we take one damage, but it goes to the growth. So uh, removes one growth, so we don't take any damage. So we'll use both of the heart to ignore. So we exhaust them and we remove two threats. So, hard to ignore. After your hero defends against an attack and takes no damage, exhaust hard to ignore, remove one threat from the main scheme. So, these are really good to keep, it, keep the threat in bay. And uh, I think we don't uh, need to ready for next turn. So, I'll just say I, I won't use the lashing vines. Then uh, Drang will scheme against Rocket, so one uh, charge gets added here, so uh, we deal two damage to each player. Then uh, Drang schemes for one plus three, so four. And we get encounter cards. Uh, roots and counter cards are assault. Okay, well, uh, two plus two is four, so we take three damage, which is not nice. I think we need to go maybe heal with Groot. And the second one is uh, Cannon Aid, uh, Hinder 3, when revealed, place 3 threat here uh, per player. So, first player action, exhaust the Milano, remove 3 threat from this scheme. So, there is 7 threat there. And that symbol is a new symbol. So, uh, this means that when we reveal boost cards, we add plus one to those cards. So I think we want to get rid of this as fast as possible. Oh yeah, uh, rockets should be ready. Okay, and rockets. Uh, so we get the drunk spear. So it just attaches to drunk. And that is the villain phase. Let's go to the next hero phase. Uh, the first player marker moves to. Rocket. I think Rocket will just heal. Oh, three. Uh, no. Let's think about it. I think we wanted four, so we won't, won't heal. 
So let's start playing cards. So mm, I'll use the. Should be ready also. Uh, these are not ready. Uh, we'll play the particle cannon uh, with genius and chase them down. Comes into play with two. And we'll uh, play uh, we need to play it in hero form. So we'll flip. Uh, we will toward for uh, we'll use the Milano this turn to remove three from here. And uh, we'll work for two. Then uh, uh, I think I'm not playing the this this turn yet. So we'll play reload. No, uh, we'll deal four damage here. Actually, uh, we don't have the. Yeah, let's not uh, remove the spear. Uh, then we'll uh, use the rocket pistol. Deal three. So we are uh, down to 13. So halfway through the first phase. And I'll reload. So, ready eats, dex upgrade you control. Then I'll just shoot again. So, six damage, so down to seven. Could actually uh, get crank down to two. Uh, to, to face through this turn. So that is all Rocket can do. We'll keep this in hand. I uh, think first thing we do is to uh, use Death Focus and uh, uh, Desperate Defense to play Root Stomp. Deal 5 damage here. And uh, I'll actually play down Starhawk. Starhawk will hit rank two phase two, so this gets discarded. But uh, rank phase two, when reveal if rank spear is in play, if rank one phase down boost card. Otherwise, that's the encounter deck and discard. Part. Oh yeah, this this was in play. So we give one boost card. After drawing schemes, yeah. The other, other than that, the card is the same, but uh, Drang gets one attack and one scheme added, and has 14 health per player, so 28. So 28 health to go, and that is Groot's turn. Uh, Groot will go to Alter Ego. We ready up and draw back up to our hand sizes. Uh, so one, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. So hopefully we're starting to get some growth cards for Groot, so we can start growing, so we get region. Okay. Well, uh, when we go to Alter Ego, we'll add two before we end our turn. Nearly forgot about that. So uh, we got Root Stomp. We are Groot Dauntless, uh, Fruition Dauntless, and Energy. 
so I think we can can just add some growth and go back up to hero for next turn with good. Uh, on rocket side we have a booster uh, boots, uh, Schadenfreude, and cannon, uh, Groot ally, and rocket pistol. Okay, well, um, we go to the villain phase, we add four threat to the main scheme, and we add one counter here. So, Drang attacks, uh, Starhawk will defend, so two boost cards. And we get uh, five, so Starhawk is defeated. Also, uh, which I forgot to mention, there is a new keyword stalwart. So, uh, stalwart villains cannot be stunned or confused, which is important to remember. So, I won't confuse or stun Grang accidentally and uh, then uh, drunk will uh, well scheme against group so we add one here so two plus zero okay so we are at 11 and encounter cards uh, we get built uh, we give this to Groot player. So I'll just exhaust Groot. Yeah. So this gets removed from the game. I'll just place it over here. Then uh, Badoom Grunt. So after Badoom Grunt engages you, if there are no other minions engaged, you deal yourself one face down and counter card. So we get that next turn. And that is that turn. Let's go to the next turn. Uh, Groot is the first player. Uh, we are not healing, but uh, we'll add two growth counters here. Then uh, we are not uh, needing the Dauntlesses, so I'll use the Dauntlesses later, maybe. Well, uh, we could play one down with the other do that. Uh, we'll use fruition to add some counters. We'll flip to hero and we'll root stomp for five and let the rocket deal with the Badoon run. So five damage here. And uh, Hmm, we could actually remove one. Uh, two. No. I think we are using. Oh, yeah. Um, I totally forgot. Uh, the only thing that mattered was that we were added one here. Because we forgot this symbol last turn, so I'll add it now. But uh, we will remove three from here. So remove this cannonade. Annoying. And uh, rocket will fort for two. Uh, we will still don't need the Sudden Uh Let's just use the rocket pistol we defeat this guy and we didn't do excess damage so unfortunately we don't draw a card I will play I'll use the boots to play a second pistol Uh, 
and I'll shoot with the pistol. Slowly we're windling down the drang. Oh yeah, uh, I forgot to play this. Yeah, uh, I think we are. Well, uh, we could just def focus to play it. Okay. So, yeah, let's let's take the top statuses. So a bit of backseas, but yeah, it is what it is. When playing two-handed, I just call for an action. So. <laughs> Later, after that. So then uh, I'll use these two. No. I just uh, keep these in hand, or I'll discard these. At the end of the round. So we ready up and go back up to our hand sizes. Groot gets uh, Flora and Fauna. I am Groot, so next turn uh, we can remove a lot of threat from the main scheme. If hopefully we don't hit an advance or anything. Fighting fits, uh, not that useful because we are not at full health. Uh, fertile ground, uh, really wanted to see this earlier, but it is what it is. We get reload on rocket, hand cannon, battery pack. Really good to get the particle cannon recharged uh, into the fray and still have this in hand. Okay, we go to the villain phase. Let's add two threat here. We add one here. Then uh, Drang will attack Root. I won't defend. Actually, I will defend. Just so that I can trigger these hard to ignore. So, uh, four, five. So we remove the tough and we trigger the hard to ignore. Remove two threat. Then uh, we'll attack Rocket Raccoon. Four plus two will remove. Off. Encounter cards. We get the Badoon Engineer. After Badoon Engineer engages you or activates against you, resolve the Badoon ship's charge up ability. So these get removed. Deal two damage here and two damage here. Okay, well, now we have a reason to use this next chance to heal. And next card is uh, Badoon Lieutenant Patrol. So we have to kill this off with Groot. And then we get Badoon Warlord. So <laughs> a lot of uh, minions arrive just in the nick of time to save Drang. But we'll see how that goes next turn. So that is that turn. Let's go to the next turn. Okay, um, Rocket Raccoon is the first player. <laughs> Some day I will remember to transfer this at the end of the round, but it doesn't really matter. Okay, um, I think we want to help out Groot by defeating the Baron Lieutenant with the Into the Fray. I'll use uh, Milano. And cannon and reload. So let's defeat that guy. And uh, yeah, I'm just playing the battery pack. So we'll use the battery pack. Then we'll use the particle cannon to kill off this. Then we will I think 
recruit can manage for them. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, I'll use the pistol to uh, do two damage here and uh, defeat this guy with rockets. And I deal excess damage, so I get to draw a card and eat this flora and fauna. Fortunately, we don't have any resources to play it this turn, but we'll play it next turn. But, um, Root will play uh, flora and fauna, and I will get two growth counters here. And I'll use fertile, uh, I'll use uh, strength and uh, depth focus to play I am Groot and remove four threats from here. And uh, keep this in hand for next turn. I think that's our uh, turn, so we managed to defeat the minions and get the threat a bit more down, so we'll ready up. We'll draw back up to 5 and 5. So Groot gets de desperate defense, indomitable fighting feet. Dauntless and fertile ground. And uh, we have energy rockets. Uh, rocket launcher. I've got a plan. A uh, uh, bug. And we have the flora and fauna. Uh, villain phase starts. We'll add two here. We'll add one charge here. Drang attacks rocket. Uh, I think Groot will defend for this one. And I'll use Desperate Defense to play the Fertile Ground. No, I'll play the Dauntless. So, Drang uh, is hitting for 4 plus 1, so 5. And we have uh, 3, 4, 5. So we don't take any damage. We can trigger the Heart to ignore, to remove 2 from here. And we get to ready with the desperate defense. Then Drang hits Groot, so Groot defense again. And uh, put Badoon Grunt into play, engage with you. So uh, we get another encounter card, because that is a force response, not a reveal action. So yeah, then we get the encounter cards. And we get a crisis of half world. So I think uh, Rocket is just going to alter ego and exhausting to get rid of this one. We don't want to discard the particle cannon. And uh, then we get group of group advanced. Uh, so we add a threat here. Uh, no, the uh, charge and. Uh, two, no, not that bad of an advance. Then the other one is uh, Badoon Sentry. Retaliate one. Okay, well, that we need to take care of somehow. So, and I think we forgot to attack with this Badoon Grunt, so I'll just remove two. Yeah, that is that turn. Let's go to the next turn. So Groot is the first player, not that much to do, uh, I think Groot will go uh, down, so I'll uh, use Death uh, Focus, no I don't have any superpowers to play, so I'll use the Fighting Feet to uh, play the Fertile Ground down, then 
we have this, nothing to play. And we'll flip, uh, we'll get to... And then a rocket will add charge here. And... Uh, We'll use Ilana to move three from here. And uh, I think we'll play the rocket launcher. Actually, mm, I'll uh, play Flora and Fauna, and I'll add two charges on the rocket launcher. I'll discard this to draw two cards. We get Salvage and Booster Boots. Mm, what do we want to play? Okay, we could play the rocket launcher. And pog. Okay, that's decent. Uh, so we'll flip. I will uh, shoot this guy. I will play the rocket launcher. I will use the rocket launcher. So this dies, that guy takes two, so one damage more. I'll play a uh, pug. And we'll, uh, because we use salvage, uh, we put one tech upgrade. So it is a uh, battery pack. And Pug will defeat this guy. Oh, yeah, and we took uh, two retaliates from the Padoon sentry. Uh, actually, only one. Oh no. Yeah, only one from the... I think... Yeah, the rocket pistol is an attack, so we took one retaliate. Okay. Uh, particle cannon will deal four here. Okay, and uh, I think that is all we can do. Be ready up. We draw the cup. Um, just keep that. So uh, we get extra encounter card. Rocket gets hand cannon, salvage, battery pack, two into the phrase. And Groot has uh, desperate defense, death focus, power of protection, cohesion, hard to ignore and intimidate. Okay, and uh, we'll start attacking with Grang. So first we um, add two threat to the main scheme, then we add uh, one here, then we will, uh, because we scheme, we add another counter here, which triggers this, so two damage here, and 
two damage here. And two plus nothing, so two threat domain scheme. And attacks here, Buck will defend. There's all the Badoom ship's charge ability. Okay. Then we get encounter cards. Uh, Root gets blockade. In there too, so we have six threat on the on this one. And Rocket gets Oppressive Armada. In there three per player, so six, uh, seven. Okay, I um, think we need to try and start burning down Krang. But we'll see. Uh, yeah, the second one is Shadows of Shadow of the Past, so we get Oh yeah this guy is dead. So we get uh, Blackjack O'Hare in play. Just move this over here. Okay, and uh, Blackjack has Quick Strike, so attacks Rocket. I. Hmm. So only one attack. If we get so unlucky that we hit it, do we even have uh, those trees here? No. Oh, a couple. I think I'll just risk it. Won't. Uh, so, one and. We deal two damage. Okay. Yeah, and because uh, we, we took a boost card because uh, Blackjack O'Hare has villainous. And uh, that is the villain phase. Let's go to the next hero phase. This should be ready. Forgot about them. Okay. Um, Rocket is the first player. Want to, we want to do we can't remove threat from the main scheme because of this so we uh, we will uh, get rid of that with Milano And playing into the fray, I'll use salvage and another into the fray. So we deal three here, and we can remove. Uh, I think. Oh yeah. Hmm. Well, that doesn't work mm. uh, okay because the into the fray removes it from the yeah so we uh, can't remove the thread so that is pointless to use that card okay so let's get these cards back. Uh, we will still uh, let's think about it for a moment. Uh, let's not use that. So, can we deal 17 damage this turn? Hmm. Maybe not this turn, but next turn, possibly. I think uh, we'll start burning down Krang. 
So I'll play the battery pack. I'll uh, use the particle cannon and charge, charge it up with this, so we'll deal four here. Then I'll use this to uh, deal two here and here. And uh, I think we are still playing the Into the Fray just to get rid of that guy. Yeah, let's uh, just play this. There are, well, put the hand cannon on top. Like we, we really don't, don't need it, but let's just do that. So we deal. Uh, damage here and nothing gets removed but it's at least dead and we'll hit for two over here so nine left on Drang and I'll flip to Alter Ego and we'll go to Groot we'll uh, add two we'll use Fertile Ground to add one We'll play our oh, draw card first. We'll play fruition to add two. We will heal back up to ten. We'll flip. Then we don't. Well, uh, we'll play the hard to ignore. Play the indomitable and. That is all we can do. Uh, we'll keep these in hand. So be ready. Uh, we'll use the Milano to still remove two from here, uh, three from here, because why not? Uh, ready up. Draw back up. We get an extra card with Groot. We get root stomp for next turn, which is good. Okay, and uh, rocket gets six cards. Master boots looking for trouble. Reload master boots and follow two and hand can. So the reload will guarantee us a kill next turn. Uh, we just have to avoid being spread it out, but I think that's manageable. So we add two here. We add counter here. Drang will scheme for, so we add another counter here. Uh, one, uh, two plus, one, so three. Still two of, of even advance in the first one. And counter cards, so we get an acceleration token here. Uh, Rocket gets uh, Blackjack's Bazooka, so we have to attach it to the villain. And Assault Surges. Uh, no, it doesn't, because we are in hero form with Groot now. So I'll just defend. I'll use the Desperate Defend. I'll play it with Milano. Uh, we get 1, 2, 3, uh, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. We, our defense is 5. So 
three. Still, we don't take any damage. Uh, I'll use all of the heart to ignore, so remove three to get rid of this one. And now I have to check. No, <laughs> we can't use this because it's only from the main scheme. But we retaliate for one. At least there's that. The second card is card of guard. We discard uh, fertile ground. Oh yeah, and uh, it took no damage, so we ready. That is the villain phase. Uh, let's go to the next hero phase and defeat Dran. So, um, this turn will be quite simple. Groot is the first player. I will root stomp for two. Then... I don't have anything to boost my attack, so I'll just attack for two. And give my turn to Rocket who will flip and uh, I think we will just use the particle cannon to deal or defeating Drang. Okay, well uh, that was the Drang encounter from the Galaxy's Most Wanted expansion, the first scenario in that uh, box and I was playing with uh, Rocket Raccoon and Groot with the pre-built decks that come in the uh, box. So uh, I really think this scenario is a good starting scenario. It's not that complicated, but it is still a lot more complicated than some of the other scenarios uh, that were in the Red Skull box or previous scenarios. And I actually just noticed one mistake I made. There should be... Uh, we got some boost cards, so I think we lost one health more here. Uh, scheming was one more. So still... Still we didn't uh, flip that or anything. So... Yeah, um, this is, is still a hard thing to remember for me, because it's such a mechanic, so hopefully I, I get better at remembering that. And actually, <laughs> now that we're talking, uh, I forgot to resolve that at least twice, so... Yeah, got some. Okay, this would have advanced, and I will advance. Okay, so... We charge it that up a bit more, so I think... Okay. Uh, well, I misplayed a bit, <laughs> because I forgot at least this once. Yeah, uh, we didn't advance this, I think. But yeah, still, uh, we got that, uh, that one card, so... Yeah. These things happen, but uh, it is what it is. There's so much to remember when you're playing two-handed, so uh, expect me to make some mistakes. If you noticed something that I didn't notice, uh, let me know in the comments, so I can learn from my mistakes and get better at remembering everything. But yeah, uh, stay tuned uh, for the next scenario. We will be playing against the Collector. Uh, there are two different scenarios. Uh, featuring the collector and we are playing the first one so thanks for watching and until next time